Tano, Jedi Nipwe, Pai Pawati, the Senator Leto, Puliani, Tikike, Tikudro, Ukwari Yamanzila, Ndawa Chiambogita, Idia, Wontunabuku, Niki and Atukomba Kona and Ampue, Mono, Tikiri Niposhi, Rikete, Nendo, Yiki, Ninge, Toyota, Tueta, and Atuendium. As provided in the Constitution of Kenya, the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission is a crucial bond responsible for overseeing elections and validating nominations to governance position. It is also the bond mandated to undertake the review of electoral boundaries. We therefore find it a major injustice that the country has gone for more than one year without a properly constituted commission. Of major concern is that the process that was ongoing to recruit the IMBC commissioners was stopped on account of political debates and deal making. We call upon His Excellency the President, Honorable William Luto, and all the concerned stakeholders to set politics aside and facilitate completion of the process. Further, we urge the Antony General to seek and diversely from the Supreme Court of Kenya on the next course of action following the lapse of constitutional deadline for the review of boundaries. Well, appreciating the effort of the government to rescue those who have been mourned and those displaced, we will call upon all Kenyans to participate in providing assistance to our brothers and sisters. We call upon the government to intensify the provision of relief and emergency accommodation to the affected families to bring their suffering to an end. Further, the nation and the county government should come up with, with clear and enforceable strategies to relocate the citizens from location that are at risk of flooding. No Kenyan should be affected by flooding year after year. On our part, we are working through our congregation to collect materials and funds to provide relief and support those caught up in the emergency.